sensational and unexpected turn in the Faria murder case. Russ Faria is suddenly released less than four years into a life sentence after being convicted of murdering his wife, Betsy. A savage killing. Betsy stabbed 55 times with a steak knife left plunged into her neck. Bombshell new evidence and our continuing investigation led to a near landmark ruling. Russ Faria is granted a new trial. After four years behind bars, Faria walks out of jail into the waiting arms of family and friends. What's up? <laughs> I was surprised. <laughs> I knew everybody was trying to get me out, but I didn't know it would be this soon. The order of a retrial followed a two-year investigation by KTVI St. Louis into his conviction after evidence that may have exonerated him was determined to have been suppressed by the previous judge. I think it made a world of difference, and I think that's kept things in people's minds and kept things on the forefront. Defense attorney Joel Schwartz believes that Judge Omer, who will decide the retrial without a jury, will hear the previously suppressed evidence, which includes statements by Betsy's friend, Pam Hupp, who drove Betsy home the night of the murder and also benefited from a $150,000 life insurance policy. I want her to be able to be questioned the way that she should have been questioned the first time, you know, because she gave several different stories of where she was when she made a particular phone call. Now fully his fate and his future freedom rests upon his retrial before Judge Omer. After five full days of testimony, Judge Stephen Omer shocked prosecutors and Betsy's family, acquitting Russ Faria of his wife's murder. After four long years of hell, Russ Faria walked out of court a free man. Prosecuting attorney Leah Askey issued this statement immediately after the acquittal. While I believe in our justice system, I disagree with his verdict. My condolences go out to Betsy Faria's family. We also reached out to Pam Hupp's attorneys and did not hear back. Russ walked out the front door of the courthouse. The night before, Pam Hupp, the sole beneficiary of Betsy's $150,000 life insurance policy, walked out of a back entrance and drove away without testifying in the second trial or answering any questions. Still, Pam Hupp has not been charged or even accused of playing any role in the murder of Betsy Faria.